All right, just a short little deco today. I was um, doing some research on King Solomon, and I came across this um, New Zealand rugby player. Uh, his name is Denny Solomana, like Solomon, King Solomon. And I just had I just had a good old laugh when I saw that he was born on or supposedly born on. September 27th, which is the Jesuit order's birthday, because the Jesuits control Freemasonry. They are above them. They are the eye on the pyramid, and Freemasonry is lower than them. And I decoded this, but it's just, you know, is this really his birthday? Probably not, because, you know, when these celebrities, these athletes, just, you know, anybody in the spotlight, anybody at all, even in a little bit of spotlight, most times, and the vast majority of the time, they sell out contracts. Um, they sign contracts that literally sign over their whole person. Literally, literally, slavery. They're signing you know, they're, they're consenting themselves to be slaves, but of course, you know, they don't read all that stuff. You know, they don't read all that they should, and, you know, they, no one reads contracts like, you know, long contracts and stuff. So, you know, they're ready to, you know, to be big time, right? And, um, you know, they're, they're, whether they know it or not, they're signing over their person. And I think that's what a lot of this stuff is, because... I just highly doubt, I mean, this probably isn't this guy's real name or birthday, but either way, if it's his real name, I highly doubt it's his birthday, Um, his actual birthday. I, I think this is just a ritual, but yeah, so with that being said, let's just, let's just decode this. So just first off in Spanish, the uh, Spanish for son is soul. That's why you have King Solomon. Soul is like Sola Victus in Ro uh, Roman mythology. Um, and, and I think it's even Soul is just short for the sun god in many um, me other mythologies outside of just Roman mythology. So, and uh, so yeah, with that being said, let's get to the numbers. So, So his name, Denny Solomana, 58, 59, those key Freemason numbers. And, you know, as Freemasonry equates to 58 and 59 in the same ciphers his name does. But this is another point, too. Um, see how Freemasonry is 158? So, the Society of Jesus, which is the Jesuit orders, which came which came before the Jesuit order, was founded on eight slash fifteen or August fifteenth. But you can also write that. That's just how we write the date, right? Eight slash fifteen. But you can also write that date how it is in other parts of the world. Fifteen slash eight. And no, uh, not no. By no coincidence, Freemasonry. 158, like 15 slash 8, right? And like I said, that's because Freemasonry controlled by the Jesuits. And to continue, you see how King Solomon is a match with Jesuit order and three out of the four base ciphers? I mean, my God. You know? So, just couldn't get more concrete. Oh, yeah, and then I didn't even say, you know, King Solomon, uh, the Masons believe that uh, they were in existence in the time of King Solomon, and they constructed his, his temple in Jerusalem, and, yeah, and that he was a builder himself, I think, but the Masons definitely believe, or and are taught, that they go all the way back, and they you know, to King Solomon's time and constructed his temple in Jerusalem. 
So where not coincidentally, Jerusalem, we know Kabbalah, um, the knowledge of Kabbalah was seized from by the Knights Templar, who was the military order of the Catholic Church at the time. And that goes back to the thing with soldiers thing. Do you see who runs the language and, and the calendar? You know what I mean? Who, who, or who runs the language, who, you know, constructed the language in the calendar? The Catholic Church, right? It's the Catholic Church. So, yeah, and, you know, the so it's like the Knights Templar were the, like, the Jesuit Order, or the Jesuits, are the new Knights Templar, right? Continuation, essentially, of the Knights Templar. And they're literally the military order for the Catholic Church nowadays, soldiers for the Catholic Church. That's why, you know, you have soul in, in soldiers. Um, because it's the sun, they're the sun cult, the Jesuits, um, more specific, uh, more so are a sun cult, but Freemasonry also, uh, teaches the importance of the sun. So, but, but the Jesuits are really fixated on the sun as they have a sun for their logo, which has 32 sun rays. Bringing me to my next point, uh, this guy, Denny Solomana, Solomana equals 32 in the most pure cipher. Like Christ, ex well, exactly how Christ does. And Christ, Jesus Christ, personification of the Son. Um, so, yeah, and then how I was talking about, uh, the Jesuits are the eye on the top of the pyramid, the Illuminati, if you will, illuminated, enlightened, light, sun. You see all this comes together and, 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 you know, the Catholic Church ultimately, you know, because they've had the Knights Templar operate out of, you know, operate for them and they've had the Jesuits, right, nowadays. And, so the Catholic Church is really, you know, they are the eye on the top of the pyramid. Um, and not by, you know, again, not by coincidence. I, 3546, like Catholic, 3546. And, and soul, again, connecting the sun, soul, sun, soul, 46 and 35. So this stuff is not a coincidence. It's all, I mean, literally, I'm just noticing soul and I, they share the same numbers, but just all in different ciphers. They share the same exact numbers in the base ciphers, just all different ciphers, if that makes sense. Okay, just a few more points that I left out. So to start off with... You know, going back to the number 32, how I connected Jerusalem, uh, uh, King Solomon, and, you know, this Denny Solomon, Solomona guy, and how Solomona, his last name, 32, and soul, son, Jesus Christ, personification of the son, Christ 32, and all these 32s in the most pure cipher, of course. Um, but I forgot to add in Jerusalem 32, where King Solomon's temple was built, where Kabbalah came from, or was, or excuse me, was seized from by the Templars, and Templars also equals 32, in the same way all these others do. So it, it's just, it, it's beyond coincidence, and... Also, another point, Jerusalem, 58, and 139, like Freemasonry, equals 58 and 139. So, yeah, that, just some more points to add on. Uh, that was it, though.
Thank you guys for watching, and I'm out. Peace.